Ah, welcome to your man of a little creature. We are back with Danganronpa. Goodbye, despair. I just got a third jab for the whole COVID shot thing. Um, my body started randomly sweating up, and I'm like an hour away from passing out. So, yeah, let's begin. After our planning meeting had ended, I quickly finished eating my breakfast. By the time I made it back to my cottage, I was already close to the time I agreed to meet Sonia. Oh man, I feel fucked up. This Mountain Dew is my saving grace right now. Mountain Dew, Mountain Dew. So, do I have to go meet the Sonia or is it free time? That is the question. Do I have to meet with Sonia? Oh, free time. Free time? Go smoke. Please? No? Alright. Dick. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to everybody that I can't talk to, obviously. Uh, alright. Where's Chiaki? In a room? Chiaki in a room? No? No? Where is Chiaki? Well, I can't teleport anybody else, but I would like to know. Well, that's suspicious. Jack is nowhere to be found. Very suspicious. I got a. She's still eating? Well, you could have brought Minimaru out. It's kind of excited to see him today. Like a little Minimaru. That's my homie. That's my homie! Mini Mar my homie! My homie! I won't forgive you! Okay. You did you get it out of this plan? Uh, yeah, I was arguing about the plan. Seriously, this last couple of episodes made me hate the shit out of Kazuichi. Totally, totally, utterly loathe this bastard. Shut the hell the abuse was You can't! No, I won't be quiet or cannot accept this plan. Hey, what happened? Man. All that money we bastard barely heard about our plan. What makes her a bastard? Hmm? Hmm? I won't forgive you. Can't, you. Your teacher can't allow this plan. Shut up! Shut up! We want to do this. We're just doing it because now it's dangerous. That's right. He's planning to kill someone. This is just self-defense. I... But what? I still can't ignore it. Just can't allow. My students to fight amongst themselves. Love. Love. <laughs> ah, shut the hell up, you useless rabbit. Looks like they're talking in circles. Might as be better if I just leave them alone. They keep shouting like that. I'm pretty sure Nagito might overhear them. Like he doesn't know what's gonna happen already. Nagito was hoping, betting, hoping, lacking. He's lacking about this. Sonia, you can be patient just for a second. Uh, I have to report to the Yakuza. To, 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 oh yeah, Bun. Uh, uh, um, my sworn brother! Hey, Fuyihiko, what are you doing? Fuyihiko? Damn right! Oh, it's just you. Oh, it's you. I was looking at this photo over here. It's the first time I've seen a photo of Peko and me where we look like equals. Damn it! <laughs> Mayuru, when the hell did you even take this photo? Did I see a flick of light in Fuyihiko's eye? Was he crying? I think I should leave him alone. You know what? I will also look at that photo. I can't look at that photo. Keep pressing. The only reason why I'm rushing this video so it off is because like I know I'm on, on like limited time here. I feel my soul leaving my body. I feel the bigger cringes behind the smaller cringes. Hajime, you are all late. Huh? I'm right on time. Wait, should I have come a little earlier? A little earlier? In my country. You are severely punished if you do not arrive 13 minutes before arranged meeting time. Bitch, please. I am the MC. You punish me, you don't get off this island. I have MC immunity. Even in your country. They'll be like, oh no, he's the MC. Can't do shit to him. For such an ordinary, orderly country, 30 minutes is pretty the opportunity rule. That is... Oh, I see. This is culture shock. I guess it can be overlooked. So, where are you planning to go? I just have to come along, right? Well? Of course. 
There's a place that pertains to this discovery we made yesterday. Chabok Island Development Plan. Do you know? Did you find something about it? Um... How should I say this? After reading this document over and over again, I suddenly realized the Future Foundation was planning to rebuild a facility on this island to use as the headquarters. We're talking about the Lord and Ad... We're talk <sighs> talking about the large administrative building on the central island, right? I couldn't find a building like that anyway. Maybe they said something about a different island. Do you have a minute? Or, what if their plan suddenly changed and they had to use a different facility? A different facility? Well? Was there not a facility on this island inscribed with a symbol of future foundation? Um... As I recall, the ancient ruin on the second island had a symbol on its door. Yeah, you're right. The Japanese word for Mirai was inscribed on there. If that's the case, that room might be connected to the future foundation, right? However... The discrepancies in the document are strange. There is no doubt that Bruin is quite suspicious. You're right. i completely forgotten about it after being locked inside the funhouse, but... The possibility that the ancient Bruin is connected to the future foundation is incredibly high. I knew there was something strange about that place. Sonia? After hearing all this, I want to go there as much as you do. I'll definitely come with you. <laughs> then, I may not be competent, so please be patient with me. You may not be competent? You may, you, it, uh, is this another dress on blondes? I see. Just asking, because it sounds like another dress on blonde, right? Uh, I'm kind of worried about one thing. How do I voice Naegi if in the previous game I gave Naegi Nagito's voice? Hey! What exactly does Kazuichi do as a commander? How should I know? Well, in games, commanders are usually flags. Flags? Um... If you defeat a commander, no matter how many of the units are left, you still, you still secure victory. Even damaging the commander is enough to decrease the opponent's morale. As far as plans go, it's a pretty standard attack. I'll leave that matter to your discretion. Wonderful. That plan is my seal of approval. Continue to target the commander. You're totally mistaken who to fight. What's the point of targeting Kazuichi? That is... You're right. What a shame. It's a shame? If Kazuichi heard that he's, rap he's rapidly diminishing enthusiasm, I plummet to the negatives. I don't know why, but I'm starting to feel... Nope. Nope. That's not the time to feel sorry for that simp. Look, man. Look. I get it. it, it he's pretty beat down. And we keep punching a man while he's on the ground. But uh, uh, Sonya hasn't stopped punching him, but... He's not dead. He's not dying except for inside, so he's fine. It is a limit of how sorry we could feel, and he reached the limit. He broke our trust, and we do not like him anymore. Right, Rajime? We don't like. Uh, agree with me, man. Agree with me, because which is sim? He's an asshole and a sim. All right. So, so long as we agree there. Hope Speed Academy. Me, me. You, you, me, 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 me. me. Uh, no matter how many times I see this place, it certainly gives me the willies. The willies? Just check on... Okay, nothing, nothing. However... Well, we should not dwell on that. After all, we are here to look for clues. That's right. There's no doubt we've found something here. Alright, let's start. And then he just like, goes to drops like right all the way onto the floor and just starts sniffing. He's like... <laughs> and Sonya's like, what the fuck? Lots of shock, maybe I should join in. It's already start snuffing. Ah. Dun, 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 dun. Well, I'm taking a closer look at it. The door looks even stranger. For a building that looks pretty run down and shabby, this door looks pretty high tech. Future, huh? Uh, obviously, I was looking at the panel, right? This liquid crystal display next to the door. That's probably it. It's probably the key. The store open it if we input the correct numbers. Please wait. We have discussed this before as well, but it would be dangerous to test it adversely. Well? If we made a mistake, it's possible that we'll be fired upon by that gun. I can think of no other reason for a gun to be there. But what if we were to hold onto the top of the gun and type the code in? Lupo, Lupo, that gun is in a completely wrong spot. 
for it to be a threat. Loophole, I'm just saying. That guy needs to be higher and aim down. Nah, loophole. As long as that's a possibility, it'd be bad if we acted recklessly. I am concerned. That is right. Courage and recklessness are completely different. If you were uh, shot by a gun like that, you would have more hills in you than a bitch's nest. You mean a bee's nest? Yeah, you are wrong. I in my country, we use the expression bee's nest. Uh, anyway, right now, we definitely shouldn't test it out so recklessly. I see. In order to I open see. this door, we might find the boss. We must find the boss at first. Or destroy the door with some kind of explosive force. No, that's impossible. This door looks extremely sturdy. It's definitely better if we find out the password instead. Alright, all we have to do is find out what the password is. Sure, let's just imagine up, conjure up the demons, and the demons of the future can tell us the password of the past. I mean, come on, just conjure up the demons. <laughs> and then the demons rose up and started telling me, like, the, the, in my mind, it's I, I came up with the, the password. And, and yeah, it didn't work. I got shot by the gun. Oh man, I feel so fucked up right now. It's a good thing we came here so we could at least find that out. You are right. But the problem is, where would you obtain that password? When we first came here, even Monokuma and Monomi said they didn't know the password. I really don't know it. How are we supposed to find out? I know where it is. After finishing our investigation of the ancient ruin, Sonia and I decided to go back to our cottages for now. Why are you guys not just going to the one place you haven't been yet that suspiciously both Monomi and Monokuma are scared of? Because of mice. You know? I would suspect some hidden information to be in there, considering it's locked and such. Free time? It's still the middle of the day. Looks like I have some free time. Now then, what should I do? Free time! Chiaki, now is the time. Now is the time, Chiaki. Where are you? Where are you? Dog, you better not, you better not, you better not never burst in the bud, Chiaki. I'll be so pissed if she does that bullshit again. Oh, wait till we get out the fun house, then we can hang out. Bitch, we, if we hang out in the fun house, we would have distracted ourselves from the hunger that we were facing. That's what pisses me off. Everybody's dumb. Hey, hey. Sonia is no good, but I'm okay. What's that supposed to mean? What should I do? Should I hang out with Chiaki? Obviously. Yep. Yeah, sure. Well? I was gonna play some games until you're ready to execute the plan. Wanna play with me? Want to play a game? That, that, uh, whenever someone asks me, do you want to play a game? I get curious as to if I should pull out my machete from under my bed in self-defense. I'm just saying, just saying, sometimes it's like, uh, actually, I could be asking me that question right now. And all I'm saying is I may need this for self-defense. Chiaki, you asking me to play a game and you, you, for all I know there's a little doll somewhere and I might need a machete in self-defense, okay? The same day by daylight. I'm not busy gonna go switch off generators. I fight you, I fight you, you and your supernatural powers. Fucking Wraith teleports at me and fuck that ghost. Try me, bitch, try me. Nurse comes at me. I know how to destroy the bubble-headed nurses. I've seen... It's a bastard. But I mean, they do it. Come on. Come at me, bro. Fuck it. The, the vomit, bitch. Please. Please. Antibiotics. Throw antibiotics at it. Like, like... Oh, wait. Relax. Take out the antibiotics. Get antibiotics at the bitch. It'd be like, <laughs> you have like COVID jabs, and be like, come here, me bitch, I'll stab you. Oh man, I'll cure that, I'll cure whatever disease you have right here. Well, well, who else is there? All the women in the game. Oh, the pig is just normal to me. I'm oh, sorry. She's, she's sneaky, she stab you, stab you. Huh? Come here, little pig. Who else is there? Um. I think we're well, also there. And don't even get me started on the females of Legion. Just like the pig, they're just normal, they like just normal chicks and dudes. Like, yeah, they have some dark paws, they like stabbing people, but I mean, so do I. Like, 
You and your knife versus me and my machete. I mean, in a battle of wits, who's going to win this match here? I'm <laughs> having too much fun this year, like, try, like trying to challenge the Dead by Daylight horror characters. I'm not even gonna touch the dudes. All the dudes are super powered. Fucking nemesis. Well, I know how to be nemesis. I played as an Evil 3 remake. All you got to say is, Goodbye, fuckface! And he'll get sad and walk to a door and disappear. <laughs> Roasted! Dark, thank you, nemesis, for attacking them for me. Damn it, I don't even have ammo. That's bullshit. Carlos! The thing is still alive! It's after me! Is it though? Run! Come back to the station! Is it really after you? Not until I get traffic control online. Is he even still there? He was on the stairs! Bruh! Fucking roasted. Roasted. Duh, you can't even deny. Roasted. I spent some day. I spent some time today playing games with Chiaki. Looks like Chiaki and I grew a little closer. Do I have a present I can give her? What would you like to give her? I don't think I do. No. No. Honestly, I. Do I have something to give her? Ajime, you seem to be holding something pretty nice. Thanks. Thank you. No one has ever given me such an awesome present before. It's a pretty wife for number one. It's going to perish soon. And she passes out. She's like, you're like, give her the book and it's like, peace out. Every single time. I can't believe how quick she falls asleep in such a short time. Samurai head. Such a liberty. How do shoot that beam there? This is bad. Zombie nation. Zombie. Zombie. Zombie nation. Eating up humans. Is she dreaming about a game? I have no idea what kind of game she's talking about. Sorry. Ah, sorry. I think I was sleeping again. Were you playing a video game in your dream too? Yeah. It's fun because it was a shooting game. I see. So you like those kinds of games? Yep. I'm pretty all inclusive. I play anything from Space Invaders to latest military shooters. And now, now, now you see why she's a wife number one. Listen to me. Because I'm all inclusive. There's certain games I stay away from though. Like the KFC dating simulator or the one where... The, like the many reverse harem dating simulators I won't touch with a 10 foot pole, no thank you. And don't even give me a, a cell start on how to fall pigeon. I played some weird shit in my life. Probably weirder than how to fall pigeon. How oh, weirdest game I've played. Thing is, I know I've played weirder games. But I can't get to the damn names and the description of it. It's kind of. Yeah, let's not get into that. Ugh. Ah, I also like simulation games. Right now, I mainly play real-time strategy games. But I like turn-based ones too. Hey, hey! So where do you want to go today? Uh, yeah, um, how about we go to the ranch today? I really don't like animals that much. Huh? Really? Hmm. They warm when you touch them, you know. That's a little scary. It's kinda hard to guess what they'll do next. Well? Buried games that use precise calculations, with success and failure is decided by numerical value. Now, uh, I prefer playing stuff where my decisions affect the total outcome. It's the reason why I love Mass Effect so much. Um, well, Life is Strange, for instance. Even though Life is Strange and Mass Effect's total outcome ended with some bullshit, two to three choice questions. Do you want that color? That color? That color? Blow up the town or save your best friend? There was only one choice. Blow up the town? Psh, fuck that shit. I, 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 you know, save the town, save your best friend. I chose save my best friend. Fuck that town. Everybody's dicks. Everybody's dicks in some way or form. That entire town is dicks. And you play Life is Strange too. And Life is Strange too. Some are worse. 
but like a billion because you call like like they actually show you the destroy town trying to make you feel sorry for what you did in the previous game and i was like I was like, I don't give a fuck, man. I actually, I, Chloe is safe. Chloe is safe. But it's hard for me to play games where I have to manage relationships and guess what characters are feeling. I see. Yeah, it has something to do with our upbringing. I don't want to do things she occupied. It feels lonely to leave her like this. How about we look at the animals from far away? The ones at the branch are pretty tame. You can even try to touch them if it looks safe. Okay. I think. If you teach me lots of things, oh. if you teach me lots of things, it'll probably be okay. I think. Is she relying on me? If so, that makes me happy. Jack and I decided to walk to the ranch. Mm. Oh my, it's a cow. No, 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 no. That's not a cow. That's a chicken. That was turned into a cow. Remember this, Jack? You weren't there. It was amazing. But I'm still curious. We should slice up this cow. Throw a steak on the grill. And eat on it. Does the cow taste like chicken? That's all I wanted to know since I started playing the second game. When I saw the cow, the, the chicken turned into a cow, I, I was like, bruh, you can't now make me curious like this and did not tell me if the cow tastes like chicken. And does the cow go moo? Does the cow go moo, buck buck? That's what I need to know. These are the questions. These are the questions. I wonder if it's going to dance like the one in Dancing Eyes. Or, or I wonder if it's going to be like, um, I too am human. Like, I'm human like all of you. Like in ADSFW. Uh, that might be a little difficult. Maybe I should try touching it a little. And if you get turned into a cow or a chicken from touching it, it wasn't my idea to let you touch it, okay? Chiaki walks up to the cow and cautiously pet it back. And suddenly, she lit up into a bright light. And... Chica from Five Nights at Freddy's? I knew that cow was a chicken. The cow seemed not to mind. And continued to silently eat grass. <laughs> oh, it's really warm. That's because it's alive. Hmm. I see. You're alright. Unlike humans, animals don't mind being touched that much. So I guess it might, that might make it easier for me. If you touch a person, something's born from that interaction, right? Repulsion, anticipation. Babies. Whatever. I'm nervous about stuff like that. Makes me think I'm better of not doing anything unnecessary. Like it's better if I just stay innocent by stand for as long as I can. Jackie's feelings seem a little odd, but I do understand where she's coming from. I hope one day she can touch not just cows, but me too. What's that? And in your endo. Ah, what do you know? If we milk this cow, I'm sure fresh milk must be really tasty. Hey, hey! Milk this cow? There's another question. Here's another question. Baffles me, man. Baffles me. This, this is a cow. It was turned into a cow from chicken. If we milk a cow, what's coming out of there? Eggs? What, like, 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 this, like, yolk? It's so like, like, pull. Yolk. Pull. Yolk. Uh, oh, what? Does the cow lay eggs? And what comes out the eggs? Is it a cow or a chicken? Is it a chicken or a cow? Is it a hybrid between a chicken and a cow? This is a This is destroying my life! Huh? Um, you know that milks come from milk comes from cows, right? What do you mean from? Milk is milk, right? You know if you pull a cow's udders, milk comes out. You only need one cow to get as much milk as you want. Huh? As much as you want. <laughs> but if you try to cut open a milk bottle, the cows comes out of it, right? Where did that come from? Don't give me more conundrums here. Don't make my life any more in an existential crisis than it really is. I really don't know about the cow and the chicken. Don't tell me about the milk and the cow. <laughs> and it dances, right? I knew it. It's definitely dancing eyes. Seriously, what kind of game is she talking about? I explain how Mok works towards Chiaki, works to Chiaki in detail. Why are there so many things she doesn't know? As usual, Chiaki is full of mysteries. Angry Parker, I'm gonna hear the video now. No. <laughs> Chiaki started to feel sleepy from playing too much, so after sending off, I returned to my room. It's a nice short one, short, sweet. Let's give me a little bit of cringe. I want you to like, subscribe, smack the face, keep it a couple of times. Don't forget to to always check out all our links in the description and pray for me. Hopefully later on I'll be able to do 
another video of this but if i can't then i can't but i'm definitely gonna try because i'm gonna study today as well but yeah pray for me she's still eating oh you could have brought mini maru out i was kind of excited to see him today like little mini maru that's my homie that's my homie